Good morning everyone and welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you are new and if you are new here. Sometimes when I've let my dishes pile up, I will do a wash your dishes with me style video. That way we can all get the motivation that we need. We can tackle this as a team. Because I don't know about you, but sometimes there's just something different about feeling like you are working together on a project with somebody. Not to mention seeing something from start of a mess to the finished product of an empty sink that is just so satisfying. So if you've let your sink and countertops get way out of hand like I have, grab your rubber gloves, grab your favorite smelling soap, and let's tackle this together. Yikes. So the thing with messes like these is sometimes you just don't feel like washing something in the moment right after you use it and you might be exhausted in your day or feel like it's just not worth the time and effort in the moment and then that keeps happening over and over again. You think, you know what, at the end of the night I'll just wash them all at once and then it happens over the weekend and suddenly dishes are piled everywhere and then you look at it and you don't even want to approach it because of how overwhelmed you are by the mess around you. It just looks like chaos and then it makes it even harder to want to get started. But I promise you that once you get the ball rolling, it will just be easier and easier. More often than not, once I get started and I get about halfway done, I look around and think, wow, I was putting that off for a really long time and it really wasn't as time consuming and as bad as I thought it was going to be. But I think a lot of us trick our minds that way about a lot of the things that we don't want to do. Another thing I do that with a lot is laundry. So another quick thing that I wanted to mention, if you've let your dishes pile up, they're all over the countertops and they're all inside of the sink and you have anxiety and you're having a really hard time approaching the sink because this happens to me sometimes where I just feel almost incapable of getting them done because of how overwhelmed I am. Um, what a trick that works for me is actually piling them in neat piles. I will grab all of the dishes and I will put them on a space in the countertop. I will grab all of the dirty bowls and I will pile them up and then I will put the cups together and everything like that. I'll clear out one side of the sink and I'll have everything in specific piles and then I'll wash things accordingly that way and seeing things somewhat organized, even if they are dirty, helps me a lot. So I just thought that was worth mentioning. If you guys have any tips or tricks to make your dishwashing experiences or just cleaning experiences more tolerable or even enjoyable, let me know in the comments below. Another tip or suggestion that I have, if you run into this problem a lot where you just have a lot of dirty dishes that pile up or Tupperware that piles up and it's just hard to manage, maybe it's just time to let some of that stuff go. Look through your cabinets, look through stuff that doesn't have tops or straws anymore, um, Tupperware that doesn't have its proper lids anymore, and just 
simplify and keep what is of use and what is necessary. That way you only have so many cups or so many plates and you won't be tempted just to keep grabbing more new ones before washing the old ones. And we finally reached the end guys. Ugh, I just love the look of a clean and clear sink and countertops. It is just so calming. I hope you guys were able to tackle something on your list this morning with me. I love you guys. Don't forget to like down below if you liked this video. Comment on what you were able to tackle today. And uh, don't forget to subscribe for more videos. I love you guys and I'll catch you on the next one. Bye!